The Dale County Agricultural Complex is getting some big upgrades. News Force Michaela Simmons shows us what they're working on and who's making it possible. $30,000, an infusion of much needed money. With it, the Dale County Agricultural Complex is revamping their facility. It made me feel great. We needed it bad. We've been needing it for two or three years. And we finally got it. Now we can get the work done. And we appreciate it. The money will cover the cost of much needed repairs, improve safety, and refresh the look of the facility. Some work on our floor of the arena. It's a little too sandy for barrel racing. And we need to do some landscaping out back. We never did get to finish it up back there like we really wanted to do. So this is going to go toward that. Bird is thankful for the help of the Wiregrass Resource Conversation and Development Council. The nonprofit helps find and secure money for groups in the area. State Senator Donnie Chestine says seeing a project like this come together is inspiring. With our merchants and, you know, just celebrate uh, all that we've been blessed with in this past year. Uh, you know, the farmers, we're thankful, so thankful for them. You know, they've had a tough year with with uh, with the drought we've had, but uh, they continue to do what they do to help us put food on the table. And then in turn, this has impacts on our merchants. So we're just, it's a good night to fellowship. In Ozark, Makayla Simmons, your hometown news leader. And the complex hosts events like the Calf Horse Show and the South Alabama Rodeo Classic. Now their pairs will take place during the winter. And for more